Thank you all for being with us today to celebrate uh, 30 years of the United World Colleges Poland Scholarship Scheme, as well as the 325 scholars who have received a life-changing opportunity to study abroad. It's a wonderful initiative. Uh, every single year we meet around 60 to 70 shortlisted candidates based on the very wide range of their achievements. Then after two rounds of interviews we select 15 of them and they start the biggest adventure of their lives. They join a boarding school community and uh, they change, they grow, they become completely different people. It's a special moment uh, because we're celebrating the, the heritage, the track record of 30 years of scholarships. I've been lucky enough to be selected uh, uh, for a scholarship in uh, 2000 to the Royal School and, and frankly it has changed my life. I went to Clifton College uh, and then I studied music at Trinity College Cambridge and now I uh, have a career in singing and I teach music in Warsaw. Like, yeah, there are so many great people around there. But my surprise was that I got in and, and now I am an alumni and I am st currently studying in Cardiff University uh, doing psychology. After going to the UK, to Clifton, I went to Oxford, studied there, stayed in England for my first job. I realized that I want to be in education and I was able to return to Poland uh, with the experience I gained in England, both in education but also in business. Uh, and be involved in uh, setting up various schools. I've got plenty of great memories with friends that I made in here because in the end nothing is more valuable than relationships in life and this is what I got thanks to this scholarship. Over a number of years we've been privileged to welcome a number of outstanding Polish students to the college. Uh, typically each year one boy and one girl will come into our lower six houses. What I've loved about the Polish scholars at Dulwich College is they've been intellectually ambitious and they've been prepared to embrace everything and they've been prepared to take academic and intellectual risks. So I'd say, I'd say carry on in that tradition, you know, be confident, be courageous. We're looking for, uh, for students who are, who are bright, academically um, curious, will throw themselves into the academic curriculum that we have um, at rugby, but also who will relish that chance of living in a community where we're together seven days a week. Can I thank the scholars, um, can I congratulate them, and here's to the next 30 years. Thank you.